I am just about to make breakfast and I think I'm going to make myself a bagel with avocado and egg. I feel like everyone on the internet has made this already, but I've never tried this before. I didn't like avocados for the longest time, so I didn't make it. But now I feel like I should try it. I should see what the hype is about. If everyone is having it, there must be something good about it. I don't usually make breakfast. I also don't have a toaster, by the way. That's why I always grill if I have bread and stuff like that. Um, I actually don't buy bread because I don't have a toaster. It's just not worth a fuck. I don't normally have breakfast, or if I do eat breakfast, it's usually like leftover dinner or something like that, which is terrible, I know, because breakfast is the most important meal of the day, but I have never prioritized it. I wanna become a breakfast girly. I really do, I really wanna try, because I need the energy. Um, I don't know if it's this time of the year or whatnot, but I'm feeling like low energy at the moment. Like, I wouldn't say fatigue, but definitely tiredness, low energy, even when I'm getting like good sleeping. Like last night I slept, uh, I think it was like 11, 12-ish. I woke up around like eight. So that's good, decent sleep, right? Eight hours. And I'm still like, well, I'm not like, I mean, you tell me, I look like I'm haggard, but I'm not like too bad. Oh, so I bought me some multivitamins. Um, these are the gummy ones, but I need to have three of these a day. Like, I'm just not gonna remember to do that, am I? Three in a day is quite a lot, but then again, I need a lot. Like, I need to almost like set timers or something like that for, to remind myself to have my vitamins, to drink more water, which sounds so silly, right? Like, I'm literally having to, um, like, I'm literally having to like remind myself to do the most basic human things, but I'm really bad at it. Also, this, Thing has a child lock, but it's also Taz proof and I can't open it. Oh, why is life so hard? You know what I mean? Ah, oh, I hate these kind of bottles. Oh, it's the wrong one. Okay, I got the right one. So basically I bought two of them because um, there's 60 tablets in a bottle and you have to have three a day. So that works out as 20 days, which isn't that much. And it was an offer to get one and the other one half price. So I got two. These childproof things. Ah, okay. And they're basically little gummies like that. They don't taste amazing, I'm not gonna lie to you, but it's very important that you get your vitamins and everything in. Obviously you still have it through your fruit and veg and all that other food stuff, but a little extra supplement can't be that bad, can it? Da -da -da. Oh, that is so not right. That's so not right. They say ripe and ready on the packaging. I don't know, because I like it when it's soft. Oh, and also the seed won't come out. I tried getting the seed out with a good whack and bring out trick, but it just cut it. Oh, and I burned the bacon, you have got to. Honestly, I'm just done. I'm actually just done. It's too much. I've got unripe avocado, burnt bagel, and who knows what the egg's gonna turn out like. Here's a breakfast bagel. I've got less than 10 minutes to eat and then wash my greasy hands and then just get on the call. That's actually so, so good. I think I ate that too quickly and now I just feel sick. <laughs> but it was like great. It was so, so good. Don't ask me why I'm on the floor right now because I don't have a proper answer for you. Sometimes it's nice sitting on the floor. It keeps you grounded. I'm the type of person that sleeps on the sofa when I have a perfectly good bed and then sits on the floor when I have a perfectly good sofa. It doesn't make sense, but we move. I've just come home after a really long day. And another thing that doesn't make sense is I did not sleep. Oh, by the way, guys, sleep routine, it's gone back to being bad. You know what, all it takes it's one late night editing session to completely screw up <laughs> your sleep routine. For me anyway. So um, basically I've gone back to a bad sleep routine. What a surprise. <laughs> well, it was fun while it lasted. It lasted for like a good week. And like, it was a great week. I was really productive and it was great, but it was very much short lived. I did not sleep well last night at all. Like I was really, really struggling to fall asleep last night. So that was fun, love that for me. So as a result, I was really tired today. And now that it's time for bed, why am I not asleep? 
Why does my brain do this to me? It's so annoying. Especially when it was doing so well. You were doing so well. And now we're back to same old, same old. Hello, hi. I am currently making myself, this is bolognese, and I've got pasta boiling, which I think might be done actually. Okay, it's never good to cook when you're hungry, which is what I do all the time. Like I am absolutely starving right now and I just cannot wait for this to be done already. And dinner is served. Today has just been a right off day and that's okay, <laughs> I say. Wow, that rhymed. Mm. Oh, that is good. I think the pasta might be undercooked. When in doubt, just eat pasta. When stressed and anxious, just eat pasta. Does it solve your problems? No. But does it make you feel a little bit better? Yes, it does. I have just done the dishes, as you can see. Um, fun fact, I don't dry my dishes. I just let it dry naturally. Also, I have a, what's it called? Dishwasher? Oh my God, that's so bad. Okay, so I have a dishwasher and I have never used it the whole time I've been in this flat. Um, because like I didn't grow up with a dishwasher so like I don't actually know how to use a dishwasher and I feel like if I tried to figure out it would just stress me out so anyway that's not even the point that I'm trying to make what am I talking about the thing I want to talk about is the fact that I just put this is a pasta and this is a leftover bolognese and I just put it in a container and I just realized I'm so annoyed with myself ow because I didn't even use my pasta bowl. This is another thing I struggle with. I am such an out of sight, out of mind person. Like if I don't see in front of me, I just will not use it. My air fryer, wow, I'm really struggling today. My air fryer, here, right? So because I don't see it, I just never use it. And I hate that about myself. I hate that if I don't see it, I just don't think about it. But basically this was, I mean, actually looking at it now, it's kind of too big might be a bit too big but like I literally made this bowl as my pasta bowl and then I had the perfect opportunity to have pasta I didn't even do it so I'm gonna leave this out basically because I'm gonna have that tomorrow and I'm gonna put it here so I remember oh god this brain is really not on it today I am currently wearing a um, denim jumpsuit, which does fit me well, but I think because it's a denim material, it's quite rigid. So I can't move my arms up below a certain point. But I also do feel like a Charlie's angel, so that's cute too. I'm just about to do my hair. Now, I'll be honest with you, I'm not very good with hair. I don't have a lot of it, so that makes my life a bit easier, but I don't know how to style my hair. I'm gonna try and do curly hair with straighteners. <laughs> Ironic, but um, you're gonna see now that it, I don't know how to do it basically. So before anyone's like, you're doing it wrong, Taz, it's like, I know, hun, but I don't really know what I'm doing, you know what I mean? I'm just trying my best out here. Straight in my face. The look I'm going for is just like, kind of like wavy, messy hair. Because I don't know how to do perfect curls, so there's no point aiming for that. I know I haven't done a good job of this, but I've also stopped caring. Oh, I always get so nervous when I hold it for a bit. All right, we've got like, we've got a little zigzag there. Love that. Bit of shape, bit of dimension, bit of texture. No idea what I'm talking about. Okay. I always get nervous, it's burning my hair. I wonder what was going through the first person's mind when they put like a hot iron to their hair. Like what was the thought process there, hun? And why did you think that was a good idea? I mean, it worked out well. I just want to know what was going through their brain. Because it was bit, it was pretty risky. It was very risky. I mean, I feel like I'm being risky right now. Um, so Lord knows what was going through their head, fluffing it out, and we're <laughs> oh, okay, maybe I don't like it, but listen, it's okay, it's okay. I don't like it, but it'll do. Do I like it? I don't think I like it, but done it now. 
what are you gonna do? This is how people show their full outfits on TikTok. Dun. This sound is really satisfying to me. And I'm gonna be working out in my Hocus Pocus t-shirt. I went to the Hocus Pocus screening, I think it was like last week, and I really like the t-shirt. We're back, witches. And I'm thinking today, I'm gonna make stir fry. But I need to buy all the ingredients for that, so maybe we'll cook some stir fry later. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be making stir fry with vermicelli noodles. I've got shiitake mushrooms, bean sprouts. Gonna put a lot of eggs in there. And then I've got carrots, onions, and garlic. And I'm just gonna bish bash bosh, put it in a pan, and we're good to go. Yeah, yeah. Okay. My kitchen is a complete mess right now. I'm gonna choose to ignore that and live blissfully and away. Honestly, not bad. Oh my god, I don't know if I'm really hungry or if this is really good, but this tastes really good. This was my first time making it with vermicelli noodles and it's so, so good. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> I realised I wasn't very good at vlogging earlier because I was so hungry. I've got to stop waiting till I'm absolutely starving to start cooking. Like I always leave it way too late. I wait till I'm like so hungry that all I can think about is just like I need the food in my belly right now, which is basically what just happened. But luckily it was worth it because um, it actually took like, it actually took really quick to make, I think like 15 minutes and it was so, so good. It was a lot better than I was expecting it to be. And I am having some milk kiss. I've got some work I need to do. I've got some memorising I need to do actually, where is it? I have to memorise a sheet of poetry. I'm going to try and do that. I think the thing is with memorising, I always put it off to the last minute. I'm like a child, you've got to like forcefully sit me down and make me memorise. Because it's just not the most like fun thing to do, is it? Because all you've got to do is just sit there and say the same thing again and again until it sticks. Um, it's like one of the most boring tasks to do, but like I have to do. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I love you lots. Please know that you matter, because you do, to me. I hope you're taking your vitamins Drinking your water. I have not been drinking my water. But I've got this bottle of aloe vera drink. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not crazy about it, but I bought it now, so I'm gonna drink it. I don't know how I feel about it. I really don't. It's like really sweet, but like... Oh, it's got bits in it too. Probably the aloe. Fever. Anyway, um, other than that, I am gonna peace out now. So I'm gonna go now. Bye!